All right, so we have here in the speaker urea. All right. Yep. It's in a lot of skincare products. It helps with dry skin. In this little packet, we have a measured amount of distilled water that's supposed to react with that urea. Now, our starting temperature for everything is 71.8 degrees Fahrenheit. All right. When we mix these two together, we're going to see, we're going to have a chemical reaction that causes a temperature change. Here is the water being mixed and poured into the urea. And we're going to give it a good stir. As the urea dissolves, it will react. We might see some bubbling here because CO2 will be re uh, produced. We may not. Depends on how quickly this happens. All right, that has been mixed. Our current temperature is already down to 44.6 degrees Fahrenheit in just those few seconds. If we touch the side of the um, glass, it is already feeling like you've got a cold glass of ice water. We keep stirring. I'm not drinking it because it produces ammonia. It would be bad if we drink it. Yes. Temperature is still dropping. It's 43. Hmm? No, it's ammonia liquid. It's it's used for cleaning products. No, we use we use urea in skincare products. So, temperature is at 41. It's right. It is very cold to the touch. We keep stirring. So pretty much don't mix your hand lotion with water and a beaker or else you'll get ammonia. The beaker is what I'm stirring it in. So if you if you notice there's not very much solid left at the bottom now. Because the uh it is being converted into liquids and gases. It's still cold. It seems to be the temperature is bottomed out at about 42 degrees. So.